right. Imperial Shrade. This is the IMP 15 CON, which stands for Amber Swirl Congress Pocket Knife. So this one, kind of excited to see. Ooh, yes. Now this one, I like the coloring on this one. Nice. Nice, nice. <laughs> we got a lot of a lot of little blades on here. And uh, this one still run you uh should run you under ten bucks. You know, there's deals out there you might be able to get for around six bucks, maybe eight ninety nine. So Bud K, Amazon, places like that is where I'm getting these knives. Just gotta weigh out your shipping options. This is four hundred stainless steel blades and we got the what they call the amber swirl handles stainless steel bolsters and pins now what I do notice right out the gate is so you got the imperial inlay which I like but on this inlay it's it's not rough but you can actually you can feel it a little bit right there it's set in a little bit deep I don't know if they do those by hand I can feel the pins so a little bit of pin snaggage right there, okay, but not too bad overall. But just to let you know, that's how that one feels. All right, let's look. Close. It's three and a half inches. All right, let's see what kind of uh, a lot of blades on here. So let's just open them up and see what we're dealing with. Got this little guy right here. This blade right here has the nice imperial shred markings on it, imperial there, and really nice the model number there, so you know what your model number is. I'm trying to do this out slicey dicing myself. Hey, that one's in there good. Got good retention. Okay, <laughs> so four blades on this one. Let's check our blade sizes. Main blade, 2.2, and I'm going all the way to the handle right here because that's how some states do it. So it would be even less the actual blade part depending on your state. And this one may be longer. 2.3 so all these should be good for a lot of states in legal carry which is most states are three inches 1.8 that one's these are approximate here I'm just doing them quick 1.9 measurements let me pick out a blade to try a little cut test all these feel like they have a pretty decent edge on them paper I've been cutting on standard copy paper yeah this one is pretty dang sharp I could tell just by feeling of it all the blades felt like that so I dig that 